Okay, here's part two. Uh, what I've done is I've taken this, uh, I just got this um, tool from Stampin' Up, and it is Crumb Cake Scalloped Tool. So uh, the edges are scalloped, and it's very cool. Um, I really like tying a knot in it, and I'm going to put the knot like right here to kind of decorate this corner. I've laid out my uh, wild orchid flowers right here. I've created a spray, um, a couple of the leaves, and this is a sweetheart, and then a tiny rose. And um, I'm telling you, the wild orchid flowers are just so awesome. Uh, normally, I have been using Mod Podge, but today I'm going to try and I will end up Mod podge in it probably, but um, we're going to use a little hot glue on this first. And I want that. I added my bird while you were gone because she really wants a bird um, to go with the, well, I mean, it kind of, the saying kind of makes you want a bird. Here's one of the mixed leaves that I, um, my pack is almost empty. And I'm going to just kind of lay that right there. And this is the biggest rose, and it's a wild rose. Sorry, but my my um, hot glue gun's not going to reach all the way over here. I kind of had smushed this up because I made my own with the flat, and I want to squish that in right here. So I'm going to add a little hot glue. Isn't hot glue like the most wonderful creation? And so we're going to have them looking nice. Here's another one I made. And I just had the flat ones and I added a rose to it. And that's going to go right here. And this last one is going to cover up that right there. And then I want to put a little hot glue on this and stick that down right in the corner. And we're probably going to need a little hot glue. My, my gun's not going to reach. I don't think, well, maybe so, maybe so, maybe a little bit. Because I want this to be three dimensional. Um, but we're going to put a little there, and we're going to put a little right there. And I really don't want the scallops being prominent, so we'll just stick that right there. And I made this little bitty spray, and I'm just going to stick this down. I like the knot, but maybe stick it down so I need to kind of hide the stems a little bit. Straighten it up. And because everything comes with the little stems on it, you can pretty much make what you want with those. And I just love that because um, sometimes you need just a little bit. Sometimes you need a whole lot. And I did add my bird while you were gone. And we're going to put a pearl in for his little eye. She, um, sorry to step away. Um, I have some pearls from the um, Wild Orchid Road, Wild Orchid Flowers site. And I was looking for my tweezers because I like to get them off with my tweezers. So here are the pearls. These are three millimeters. And this this came with like three different colors. This is light, lavender, black, and then the white. So we're going to use the black one on his little eye. And put that on. Doesn't that just bring him to life? Mm -hmm. When I squeeze him, his glue is coming out from underneath, which is an okay thing. And we're done. Isn't that just going to be a lovely gift for somebody? Hope is the thing with feathers that perches in the soul and sings the tune without the words and never stops at all by Emily Dickinson. And I can't help but think a prayer when I hear that. Thank you for stopping by. And please comment. I know I'm not, I'm still working at this YouTube thing, so thank you so much. I really appreciate it.